Home invasions and armed robberies in the historic Northeast have Sheffield Neighborhood Association Mark Morales concerned. Maybe as a president, we weren't providing enough outlets for the families, for the kids. Maybe we weren't utilizing our parks more for the kids so they have a structured activity to do. As a member of the Hispanic community and resident of the Northeast for 58 years, he says folks in his community might be living in fear. Especially when it comes to the home invasions, that's their sanctuary, their place, you know, and when they've been violated like that, it's just hard for them to come out, hard for them to feel comfortable, hard for them to trust other people. Especially for many who might be faced with a language barrier, which Mark says could make it hard to trust the police. Maybe they don't see a police officer that looks like them, that they can't communicate, they, they can't communicate with all the time, so they don't, so they're just kind of keeping it to themselves. But after a message was recently delivered on this crime spree by Deputy Kansas City Police Chief Luis Ortiz, John Fierro with Maddie Rhodes hopes this sends a message to the people of the Northeast. And I would encourage them to call 911 knowing that uh, someone on the other line can speak the language. Uh, there is a sense of uh, cultural competency on their part. Now both Mark and John are hoping that the community can come together to put an end to this crime. Let a neighbor know, let a neighbor know, maybe create a little block watch on their block just so someone on that block could be the per se block leader so they feel comfortable what's going on. In Kansas City, Leslie Delasport, KSHB 41 News.